Welcome back everyone. Uh, in this video I want to go over the issues that co-op is currently facing right now. Uh, specifically non-event co-op. I know a lot of people have been having uh, a lot of things to say about regular co-op right now. I see it pretty much everywhere. I have friends talking to me about it, complaining about it, people on my stream. I see it on Reddit. I see it on the Discord. Pretty much everybody unanimous, unanimously thinks that basic co-op right now is not in a good state. And I'd argue it's probably in the worst state of any content piece of this game. Because it's a it's a it's a piece of content that you can do anytime you want, but you never do it because there is no use for it, right? There's almost never a use for it. You know, if we, if we go into say solo content, there's there is generally going to be some kind of use for these enhancement quests. You got synthesis, you got the premium which you'll do daily. You got the training quests um, if you need some of those pieces, um, you know, and then the weapon quests. So like these all have a use at some point. You know, even I find myself being a day one player, I'm still doing these on occasion or I do them when I need to do them. But um, but the co-op, regular co-op, I don't touch this ever the only time i ever will go in here to do anything is if they have a new a new boss or new co-op enemy in here i go oh hey yeah I, I don't have the crystals for this guy or he's brand new so let's go ahead and take care of him and and that's it i don't touch it after that and i get that the devs are trying um to try to you know do something about this help it because there's a lot of people who can't even get find people in co-op and it's understandable because the co-op is trash um and and so like you know their their thing was clear 10 co-op battles with the exception of event right so it didn't include the current event going right now which is the golden bomb rush and the sephiroth event um i've run the sephiroth event at this point probably over 250 300 times i have done a ton of co-op through this um and and for the regular co-op I, I basically have not touched it whatsoever there's no reason for me to touch it so to clear that i literally came in I did 10 of these really low stamina ones at 1x stamina cost. That way I'm only spending 100 stamina. Figure, hey, 100 stamina for 10 tickets, that's a great value. And then I'm never going to touch this again. So, so what, here's the thing. What, what can the devs do to fix this? You know, what is, what is necessary to make co-op worth it? Or make, uh, help people do co-op? Or, you know, whatever it may be. They have multiple options. Uh, and, and the two I think that are, that would be the most beneficial is, is, uh, the first being, um, make some kind of AI team where, Hey, you, you're trying to do co-op. Um, you don't find uh, other players within X amount of time automatically give you, um, some AI teammates or whatever to play with. So that way you can at least attempt the content or do it, you know, in some sense, because as it stands, there might be some of these fights where you can sit there forever and you don't find anybody because nobody's doing them because there's no reason to do them. And that kind of touches on the second way to fix it, um, is make, make the, the, the items and drops you can get here, give them, put something valuable in here. Right? So like, as it stands, you know, why would I come in here to do any of this stuff, right? I can get all of this stuff in much better amounts in every other part of the game, right? I mean, I have 3,000 of these. Why? Because I get these from all of the weapon enhancement quests that I do for the genome and the nanopods. So there's no reason for me to get these off of here, right? Frost crystals. I don't upgrade materia enough, or at least I don't upgrade it because I don't get good enough materia that I, that I want to upgrade to make me use any of these kind of crystals. Right? Same concept with the magic tumble. I don't use these for pretty much anything. Right? So a lot of these, a lot of these things in here, there's really no point you going to co-op to get this stuff. They, it, there needs some kind of there needs to be something here of value. There's there's not enough value to make me do co-op. I mean to give me, you know, some of these things, it's just not worth it. You know, it's just I would never come in to do these. It's just there's, there's just no point. There's no point in anybody grinding co-op for any of the materials. So everybody is going to come in pretty much once they're done being a small fry uh, or their new player. They're they're never going to come in and touch this again outside of just maybe being required to do that. But even for the the weekly co-op medals, you're going to go into the event to do this stuff. There's no, you might as well use the event because the event's going to give you things and you're going to want to 100 percent and get everything out of the event. So. So two big things, right? You need AI and then you also need, um, or some kind of AI party, right? And then also value. There's no value in doing co-op. The other issue is, is just in co-op itself. Um, and it's the fact that, that co-op is a pain, you know, I mean, as somebody who's done it a thousand times, um, it is a pain to deal with people in co-op. Primarily it's the timer, right? I think the timer is the biggest issue. 
um, in, in multiple ways. One, when you find a party, you're sitting there for over, th you can potentially sit there over three minutes with a group of three people and all you're waiting on is one person. Automatically, if somebody doesn't, I would say doesn't ready up in 20 to 30 seconds, I'd probably say 30 seconds, that person, instead of the whole thing having to wait for, for the timer to go all the way down, the, that person should just be kicked out of the party, right? Let the two people who are in there ready to go and bring somebody brand new in. And that way, you know, you're not having people sit there forever and annoying us with the co-op. And the second thing is just the same concept. When a fight is over, um, you know, don't, don't hold us hostage or if you fail a fight don't hold us hostage and require every single person to participate in saying to retire um or continue right so like i, I get i get why because you have the option content to continue if you want to spend the 100 crystals and i have very rarely on occasion seen people do that um but i i want obviously it's not recommended you should pretty much never do that 100 crystals is way too valuable but um but yeah again holding us hostage if you fail a co-op should not be a thing if you if one as soon as you hit retire you should be kicked out of that of that fight i've even had it where i've been stuck there i literally exit the game i open the game back up and it actually throws me back to the screen where i am stuck and i can't leave because somebody who was playing on auto didn't do anything so there's a lot of updates and things that need to be changed for co-op um the, and it's a big reason why a lot of people i think avoid it outside of doing it for necessitary purposes or for for a max efficiency right so for instance for me like i've been grinding the heck out of the the, the sephiroth here for the gold tickets and i'm doing co-op on it but it does take some time i would prefer to do solo because i don't have to wait on anybody and but co-op can potentially be faster and then at times co-op is a absolute drag it can take me five minutes to get a party together or something like that uh or because people aren't readying up so i have to leave like five six seven parties every once in a while in a row to find a party to do it there's somebody that's going to ready up so uh you know these things need to be fixed i definitely hope the devs are watching either this stuff they're listening to anybody because man this stuff has been a problem since day one and they still haven't done anything about it um so yeah man uh, I, let me know what you guys think what else uh, needs to be switched with co-op uh, appreciate you watching keep rocking and i'll see you next time peace Thank you for watching the video. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to hit like and subscribe. You can catch me live every single day on Twitch and YouTube. So be sure to check the links down below in the description for my channels. And I will see you guys on the next video.